President Venezuelan self-seeking to shake hands with the U.S. military. Civilian Venezuelan President Juan Guaido sent a special envoy to meet Pentagon officials to propose cooperation in dealing with the political crisis in South America. We directed our Ambassador Carlos Vecchio immediately to meet the South Command U.S. and the commander of this command to establish a direct relationship, said opposition leader Juan Guaido told a rally in Caracas on May 11 to revive the spirit of supporters after an unsuccessful coup attempt in late April. We have said from the beginning that we will use all the resources we can to create pressure. We are at a historic moment, or we become prisoners of fear, despair and no action at all, or we will continue down the road with hope, strength and faith, Gato told a crowd of about 1,500 people in Alfredo Sotol Square. In a comment on Twitter, the U.S. South Command said it was ready to discuss how to support the future role of Venezuelan naval commanders, but who will make the right decision, put the Venezuelan people first and restore the constitutional order by taking the position of the presidential president, Juan Guaido. The South American Command also confirmed that the force was ready to act immediately after being invited by Mr. Guaido and the Venezuelan legal government. Opposition leader Juan Guaido has mentioned many times to work with the U.S. military in dealing with the current crisis in Venezuela. In an interview on May 10, Mr. Guaido said it is acceptable that the U.S. intervened in Venezuela if Washington proposed this option.